we have new details now about the trail of horrifying violence that left three members of a local family dead. Tragically, that includes an eight month old infant found dead on the 405 freeway. Police now saying they were pushed out of a moving car. KTLA's Rachel Menatoff joins us live from Woodland, Hill, Woodland Hills with details. Rachel. Share Sandy LAPD confirms this was a murder suicide. Police say after a verbal altercation, a woman stabbed her partner inside this Woodland Hills apartment complex. The victim's family tells us he was an Air Force mechanic and a loving father to their two children. Now his homicide is connected to two other fatalities all within the same family. A shocking scenario of twists and turns ultimately ends in tremendous tragedy. LAPD confirms 34 year old Danielle Johnson stabbed and killed 29 year old Jalen Allen Cheney in their shared Woodland Hills apartment when a heated argument turned violent early Monday morning. She then took off down the 405 with her two kids, pushing her nine year old daughter and infant from the moving car. The baby was killed and the little girl injured but survived. Johnson continued driving, her car going over 100 miles per hour before she crashed into a tree on PCH in Redondo Beach. I looked at my phone and I saw that there was two kids found on the side of the 405 freeway and their ages and I screamed. And I called my husband and my, my daughter up and I read them the article. And we all knew at that point it was our neighbors. It was obvious. The couple's next door neighbors woke up to a trail of blood leading from the apartment to the elevator and immediately called for help. Their front door was wide open. It was like propped open. And um, I saw pretty much it was in disarray in there. I mean, the knocked over furniture and, and blood. I told them it was a three story. The bedrooms were downstairs and uh, stood there as they said, I see a body down and they pulled their guns and said, if anyone's in there, come out with your hands up. Richard and Jody Berglund didn't know the couple personally. According to family, Jalen was in the Air Force, served four years in Italy, where he likely met Danielle. He was an aspiring meteorologist. His brother tells KTLA he didn't know the details of the couple's relationship. As for his daughter, she's being treated for her injuries at UCLA. She's the sole survivor and likely the primary witness to a series of unimaginable events. Knowing that that poor child saw what she had to see and experienced what she had to experience on the side of the freeway and, you know, losing her mother the way she's now lost her mother and probably the last memory she have of her mother is not going to be great. And uh, I, I just can't. That, that is going to haunt me forever. CHP tells me it's interviewing all witnesses, including the nine year old girl who survived this ordeal as part of its investigation. We're live in Woodland Hills. I'm Rachel Menatoff. I'll send it back inside to both of you.